Buongiorno, evening, my friends. We're back. Buonasera. We're here. Buonasera, as they would say in the, in the old world. Check this out. The wall's done. Got to put the speakers back, <coughs> back up. Wouldn't you know, two things here went wrong. I noticed little lines. You can see them here, but they'll probably go away when it dries. One of them, I went to paint it, and the paint peeled right off because this, this stupid textured paint is going to be the death of me. Because the paint... Never do it, guys. Don't do the it. new layer... Yeah, never do it. The new layer of paint is on a thin layer of spackle with a thin layer of primer and therefore still loose when it's wet. So I have to wait and I'm going to try and paint that with a little brush. And number two, I don't know, I'm not going to blame Laura for it because neither of us know who did it so I'm going to say I probably did it. This know. chair was here and it got put up against the wall and the, the paint is wet. And now my sleeve on my coat is now white. The moral of the story is don't wear a coat folks. Not enough paint. Not at all. Never wear a coat. If you do, there's a chance you'll paint it. Trust me on that. I think I've ruined every one of my coats at some point or other with paint. Good. Yeah. With paint. Every one of them. Can't remember. We built this place. We built it. Although for the new place, the new studio, I'm working on blueprints for it. It's going to be identical to this one. But it's very important that every measurement is a match so everything fits. This is going to be different up here. Although Dave, my friend Dave, if you're watching, Dave, we need you. Come back to New Jersey. <laughs> he made these for me. He has a shop. And he made these. They're originally, I don't know if you guys are familiar with the decals on the side of like a, a truck or a van. You know, like the, when the company logo is on there. You look like an Oompa Loompa, so yellow. Is it? Well, you look like an Oompa Loompa with a carrot. So, he printed these out for me. Now, I think he actually had to make the social logos. Because you can see like they don't look like the real ones. Like that's not the real YouTube logo. Ow. But this... I had made this and sent him an EPS file or whatever it is that you need, thickened it up because you can see that's a lot thicker than the Laura in the kitchen font normally would be. So it wouldn't be too thin and peel off. But I can't take them with me because they're right on the wall. So I'm going to have to find out. He's going to have to come back from Hawaii. We're going to have to call him back. Dave, we're calling you back. What do you think of that? I can call Gary. Maybe he'll be able to do it. But... I mean, I when we were in Italy. My grandmom steamed carrots for me, little Laura. Mm -hmm. Little Laura loves her fruits and veggies. She loves her fruits and veggies. She especially loves carrots. You're not blurry. I think a blur problem might be done. Guys, I've said it before. I have the best life. I'm sorry. <laughs> All because of your All because loaded of potato soup. Loaded potato soup and a bowl of cheese. It, it is, just so you guys are, know, like it is, this is like the best. I don't want to make it for it. It goes, goes nuts over it. It's so good. Make sure you try this one, guys. It is not up yet. And it won't be up until... Thursday. 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 It's good. Well, this video will be up by Thursday because we're doing the Emerald event on Thursday. We want to make sure that this is up by Thursday. No, I know. That's what I'm saying. It won't be up by the time you watch this. It will be up by the time you watch this. I'm putting this up on Tuesday or Wednesday. The video, the soup will not be up by the time they watch this vlog. That's correct. I was wrong. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I look like the guy from Dead or Alive. You gotta shut it off. You got. I cannot be seen. I. I know. I can't. should age gracefully okay and when you're young that's your time to fly when you get older step back and let the young ones fly well I believe that we all have our um, our time I mean everybody has a time when I was young you know I went out I had a great time I partied you know like you know clubs everything after a while everything falls apart just like a car So I've been getting a ton of questions from you guys about uh, whether or not the uh, live event is still going on. And it is, so if you're watching this on Wednesday, this vlog, then you want to tune in tomorrow on Thursday, Thursday the 8th. It's the Snapware Winter Warm-Up. And there she is over there, she's wearing her shirt. Her... I'm pumped! She's pumped. Um, it's the Snapware Winter Warm-Up with Emerald at noon on the 8th. And if you want to ask questions, that's right, everybody wants to ask some questions, you got to tweet, um, soup in a snap. Hashtag soup in a snap. I'll put the hashtag down below so you can see it. Make sure you get in there, get some questions in, show up, have fun. So, anyway, get your questions in early and they're more likely One to be seen. One last to say, BAM! So what's the least cool thing that you've done 
this week so far. Burning myself? So yeah, that's pretty uncool. How about you? I got poison ivy in my belly button yesterday. <laughs> don't ask. It's a long story. Better if you don't ask, folks. Fact of the matter is, you should never clean your belly button right after you crawled in a patch of poison ivy. Never. Note to self. Note to self. And you think, where did he find poison ivy? It's the middle of winter. Well, it well, found there's me. A will, there's a yes. way. Uh, for my entire life, poison ivy has just found its way Someone just to me. Six times. Do you know who they are? Oh, because it's when they do it too many times, it doesn't show you? What's that all about? Oh, I said it. Mm. Well, that makes sense. I don't think she's ever texted anybody only one time. Alright, guys, I don't do this often. Hold on, I'm going to try and get the lighting adjusted on this vlog cam to show you the magic that's sitting right here. Alright, well, it ain't perfect, but it's the best I could do. This. Let me lower this down a little bit. Lower it down, the magic station here. This is a triple chocolate pound cake. Coming to you soon. All I'm gonna say is I haven't cut into it yet, but I saw what goes in it. And it looks amazing. I'm just I'm gonna hypnotize you. Check this out. Let me just say how pleased I am that you guys loved Maria. She's funny. <laughs> She's funny. Laura's working. Um, I've been staring at the screen for hours. What's that? <laughs> She's been staring at the screen for hours. So, I want to show you guys something cool. Check this out. So, for our new studio, I got the pump. And nobody really cares. But I got it. <laughs> it's a pump for, um, for the sink. Because the studio needs to pump the water to another location and go into the drains and all. It is dark in here. I'm sorry. How are you, baby? I'm tired. You're almost done, right? Feels like it, but it's never done. You got tissues here, my little sick one. So, um... It's never done. I think I'm going to go make you dinner. I'm oh, no, go... no, don't sit on that. It's just glass. Please don't sit on that. I'm going to go make you dinner. I'm going to make you scallops with linguine yeah. and tartar sauce. No? All right, so you guys, I wanted to show you this. This is a neat little thing here. It's actually, I used to have one of these when I was a kid, when I was like 12. You know, every 12 year old needs one of these. So check it out. This is, it's a, it's, you could use it for a lot of things. You could use it to find Lara when she gets lost in the woods. So what you do is you, you push happen? the button on that, and then you take the back of it. Look at that, you got all these little options here. Let's say you have a wire in a wall and you don't know where it goes, or you have 25 wires and they all go to the same place, like a network switch, right? And you don't know, you know which one's which. Well, if it's a network switch, you take this one and you plug it into the wire that you're trying to trace, or like a network jack, or if it's a phone jack, which who the heck uses phone jacks anymore? Half the people watching this probably never even saw a landline. I would say anybody I under- I want one, but you think it's- She wants a rotary dial phone. No, I want a phone line. So anyway, what you do is you plug it in, or you can use these two jacks here. You plug it in, and it starts transmitting, and no matter where the wire goes in the wall, to 328 feet. Wait, do any of you have a phone line still? And should I get it? I think I should. I have an Italy, How you have an Italy phone. I cell phone when it's lost in the house? How can I call it when you're not here? Me.com, log in, hit find it. Oh yeah, I'm gonna do that. Just get my phone so I can call my cell phone to find it. Check it out. That's the point. Then you take this fancy pants little thing right here, and as you get closer to the wire in the wall, this thing beeps. So you can find all the wires you ever wanted to find. Wow, somebody's really tired making me I yawn. Did really any tired. of you just yawn because of that? I'm sorry. Did you just yawn? I'm really sorry. So, oh, it's on my nerves. There's too many things on it. All right, I'm going to give you guys a couple of things to think about. One, in Skyfall, James Bond. We're watching. Fall, no, no, we're not watching. We're not watching what, more James Bond. Guess what Holly's watching right now? What? Casino Royale. Well, guess what? I'm watching it tonight. What? I've seen Casino Royale, Royale this week. I can't watch it again. You're you making know, me watch them all twice. You saw it two weeks ago. She's not making me watch them all twice. She wants to go back and watch all three of them again. Yes. I said, just wait till the next one comes out. No. Watch them all back to back, and then you know oh, what's going to happen. I'm watching them then too, but I'm watching right now. Listen, listen, Linda. Look at, look at Linda. Look at, look at, look at, look at. 
um, it's funny. We, I don't know if you guys catch them. I mean, I'm sure you guys catch them. We quote a lot of like viral YouTube videos, and Laura quotes them in Laura in the Kitchen. Sometimes people catch them like Crispity Crunch. But I don't know what um, it's just like my uh, head. It's just for decoration. Not a lot of people know that one. It, woo, woo, woo! It's just for decoration. That's it, and that's all. Thumbs up if you know what I'm talking about. And if you do, consider yourself my new BFF. Come over and hang out. And if you don't, you better Google whistle tips because it is the funniest <laughs> video I've ever seen. Whistle go. Woo! The whistle go. Woo! You should be up making breakfast. You should be so, up making breakfast or something. You've got to watch it. Check this one out. Have you guys seen this? This is from when we went to St. Louis. Look at that stud. Uh, she ain't bad looking, but no compliments, so. Oh, you, no, you're, you got nothing from me. I can't compliment. I mean, he, could, he, you know, he looks fine and all, but. No. You ain't no James Bond. <laughs> so speaking of James Bond, I got a question for you. It's Skyfall. Let's see. This is Laura's. Laura's got to answer this oh. one. Okay. I got this. Okay. So James Bond. Daniel Craig. Walks on the ice with the bad guy. Yes. Shoots the, the ice, falls into a frozen lake, mm -hmm. chokes the guy, and kills him when he's underwater. Now, why would choking somebody kill them if they're already underwater and they can't breathe anyway? Well, just going to make a couple things clear. A... You don't know that he died from being choked because you saw him go in, they saw him fight, and the next thing you saw, you saw him come into church and got No, hit. he goes ah, underwater and, ah, and, ah, and ah, ah, Mr. Ah, Craig has his ah. leg around his neck and he chokes him to death and, he right. fall, and the other guy falls to the bottom. So, so you're that. telling me you choke somebody when they're not breathing anyway and they stop breathing? Yeah. Hmm. Let's see if we can find her. Oh. Oh, there she is. <laughs> See, I told you guys it would work. It works oh so well. I don't really like that noise. All right, so what are you doing in here? Why are all the lights off? Playing words with friends with Isabella. We've been in the same game for about two and a half days. What's what's uh, your craziest word you've ever used on words with friends? And please don't tell me you're addicted to that game like the rest no, of the. No, I can't. I, I don't have I don't, I don't have the attention span to beat the play. That's why it's taking us two and a half days to play one round. I was on there. I played it one time, and then. I couldn't stop after that. You were addicted to it? Well, it's because everybody just starts jumping in. I mean, people you haven't talked to in no, 10 years start adding you in games. I only play with um, three people. <laughs> and not often. Because it's very frustrating. It's like, dude, I was saving that spot for my word and I used it. It really looks like a doctor's office in here with that color. The, the light is very blue. Oh, you know why? Because I changed the setting on here the other day so that it would look right downstairs. I'll bet you the color's been off ever since. I'm sorry about that, guys. Joseph, how dare you? Oh, how dare you? Okay. How dare you not notice it and change it back? Word, we're just, oh my goodness, my sister, by the way, she's using naughty words. Okay, so this is the crazy thing I discovered. You go into YouTube, you click on your little picture in the top right, you hit YouTube settings, you go over to email on the left here, boom, email. And in your email settings, there's a button here, because so many people ask us all the time, how can I get an email or an update? I'm not seeing your, your uploads on Lara in the Kitchen or on the Vitalis, it's not notifying me. So. If you're having that problem or you want to get a notification every time a new video is uploaded, you go in here, you go to edit settings. Like this is kind of tucked away if you ask me. So you click on email. Once you've clicked on the little settings gear, go to email, click on get emailed right when your favorite channels upload new videos and hit edit settings. Now in here, you can go in and you can type in or you can check off whichever channel it is that you want to get the notification for. So if we wanted to get a notification from April, we check off send me updates and you get to choose all activity or uploads only so chances are you might just want uploads only you might want all activity and then once you've selected it well, i think we had all activity you can just leave it like that and i don't even think you have to hit save i think it just automatically saves your selection it's pretty cool isn't it now i had no idea i just stumbled across it the other day when i was looking through here for different kinds of settings and i was very pleased that the option is there but i felt like it was kind of tucked away and hard to find so that answers a lot of the questions we get about not getting notified when there's a new video. So if you guys want to go check it out, that's where it's at. And you know, I got to go in and taste test it one more time. Yeah, one more time. One more time. You got to taste test. Guys, you definitely check this out when it goes up uh, Thursday. Yeah. Which, by the way, if you're watching this vlog, it's going up tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. so as the, the event is tomorrow at noon, this will be up tomorrow on Laura's channel. Make sure you're there. If you're not there, then we are be going there. to question your, our friendship. Beta. Beta. Alright, well, I hope you guys enjoyed. We will see you in the next one. Make yes. sure you hit that love button. And um What's my, we'll see you next time. my spoon. Mm. I ate your spoon. Okay, so I learned why they call it a 
pretty to look them. Yeah, but it's never been this big before. It's never been this big. Maybe I should have got a salad.